This is the Officials Institute with Five Play Challenge. How many will you get right? Basket interference and goaltending. Play number one. The game official rules. Basket interference. Was he right? How about now? Did you change your mind? Let's break this play down. Since the player is dunking the ball, contact with the ball inside the cylinder is legal. However, the ball bounces away from the shooter's hand and is no longer considered a dunk. When it re-enters the basket, the player is still touching the ring. The correct ruling on this play? Basket interference. Here it is again. Play number two. The official rules a basket interference violation. What do you think? Still have a violation? Or was the block legal? Let's break it down and see. When the shooter releases the ball, it is blocked outside of the basket. This makes the touching of the net irrelevant. Correct ruling? Legal play. Let's watch that one again. Play number three. Did you see that one? The official called basket interference. See at that time? Was the official correct? Here's the breakdown. After the shot, the ball gently bounces on top of the ring. This means the ball is within the cylinder. And the defender touches the ball to bat it away. Basket interference was correctly called by the game official. Let's play that one again.
play number four. The ruling made during this game was goaltending. What do you have? How about now? Still see goaltending or was that a legal block? Let's slow it down and zoom in for a closer look. Four factors must be met to be considered goaltending. It must be a try for a goal. Check. It has to be entirely above the ring, which it is. There has to be a possibility of it entering the basket, probably. And it needs to be on a downward flight. Was it? Marking the height of the ball frame by frame it is still too close to know for sure. The correct ruling on this play, inconclusive. Here it is, one more time. Play number five. There is no whistle on the play. Should there have been? Did you get a better look that time? Let's break it down for analysis. Again, using the four factors needed for goaltending, we first ask, is it a try for goal? Yes. Is it above the ring? Nope. Does it have a chance to go in? Sure. Is it traveling downward? It is not. The official correctly rules this play as a legal play. Go ahead and watch it one last time. How many did you get right? Leave us a comment down below and tell us. Thanks for watching our five play challenge. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel. This is the Officials Institute. Have a good game.